In this video, you're going to learn about five ways rich people make money with debt. And by the time you finish watching this video, you'll learn exactly how to make money from nothing. In other words, you'll learn more than 99.9% .9 of all the people. Hello, my name is Mark Daniels, a broke factory worker turned entrepreneur years back. My life was not that good. I was borrowing money from friends and family just to make ends meet. I remember those days I was frustrated, overwhelmed, confused, only because I wanted to be an entrepreneur and I want to be financially independent. Now my life is absolutely blessed. I can go anywhere I want. I can take a vacation anytime I want to, and I can enjoy life and buy anything I want. And this is what I want to talk to you about, how to become financially independent through debt. I want you to relax because I have nothing to sell you. I don't have a course plug in this video for you to purchase for a thousand or two thousand this is absolutely free i'm going to be making more videos about the secret of millionaires of how to start making money very quickly and believe me you don't want to miss that so make sure to subscribe and hit that notification and like the video as well if you cannot figure out a way to make money while you sleep you're going to be working till the day you die. Warren Buffett said that. And this is all about passive income. So I'm going to go ahead and give you an example of one of my friends. He just bought a Ferrari. We were just sitting there talking about it. He said, I spent $273,000 on this vehicle because it is a very good one. And it's a very good asset. Well, you know what's wrong. It's not an asset. So the first thing that you need to understand, and if you get this point, then you are on the way to prosperity. Now you have to understand what is a good asset and what is a bad asset. Of course, a lot of times uh, people borrow from the bank or the institution, financial institution to borrow and to purchase that asset. So I'm gonna go ahead and make it very simple for you. Anything that you sit on is not an asset. A car, a boat, a motorcycle, a jet ski, even an airplane is not an asset. You're probably wondering why? Well, simply because they depreciate over time. Now, what is a good asset? Is something like a house. You don't sit on it, obviously, but it appreciates in value each and every year. And I'm going to prove that point to you. Since the beginning of time, not the beginning of time, but even Andrew Carnegie, as you probably already know, one time he was the richest man in the world. He always said, I never use my money. I always use other people's money. And this person worth billions of dollars. And in the modern world, nothing is different. So I'm sure you figured it by now. Number one is home financing. It's time to give you some examples now. Mark Zuckerberg, when he purchased his house, he's worth billions of dollars. He never paid his money. He used other people's money. He went to the bank and he got a loan. And the list goes on. Elon Musk, Jay-Z, Beyonce, they all did the same thing. Even though they have the money to pay maybe for 500 houses, they went to the bank and they borrowed money. So they're smart enough and you're going to be smart enough to do the same exact thing. So when you go to the bank and you borrow money, you borrow money based on your credit, obviously, but it is going to be anywhere in between one, two or three percent. Well, the inflation rate right now is over five percent. What does that mean? That means you are borrowing money for free. And this is how the rich think about it. They are getting that money for free. Why should they pay for it? And they don't pay for it. They use that money to do other things that make them more money. This is how they get rich. This is how the rich gets richer. And the poor are still confused about what's going on around them. So remember, the first investment that you can do to become financially independent is to own a house. There are two reasons for it. One of them is that you have to live somewhere. You either have to rent and give somebody else money and use that money to better yourself. How to make money with debt number two is refinancing. If you already have a house, many 
people refinance their house. For example, refinancing right now is about 1% or so because you already have collateral. And remember, the inflation rate right now is about 5% so that you are way ahead of the game. Then what they do is that you take that money and you start a business or you invest it. There's a lot of ways that you can invest it that I'm going to talk about here in just a little bit. How to make money with debt number three. You can call it home equity. A lot of people, what they do, they take the money, they put it in an index fund. The index fund is averaging. I'm not gonna go through all the index funds because this is not the subject of this scope of this video, but index fund is averaging over 89%. So if you are getting your money for free, and or even 1%, and then you get in about eight or maybe 9%, it's a good way to invest your money passively. Number four of how rich people make money with debt is hedge funds. Hedge fund is simply a betting system. Uh, you probably know a lot about it from GameStop. What they do, there are a bunch of funds out there. What they do is they bet against the a company, they look at the financial and they see that company is going down. So what they do is they bet against it. It's also called as an individual, it's called shorten the stock. So it's very important to understand it. It's I don't wanna say that this is what you should do. I'm telling you, this is what a lot of the rich people do. And there is a tremendous amount of money that could be made from simply hedging your investment. Number five, which is credit score. I cannot emphasize this enough. I know a lot of people that have, or they can get a credit card, for example, but uh, they have this thing about, uh, I don't like debt. I'm not into debt. I'll never become uh, a owing anybody anything because they have that perception, which is an ugly perception about debt. Well, rich people, millionaires look at it the opposite way. I've never seen anybody who hate debt and at the same time is a millionaire. Never happens. So how to increase or have a good score? Number one, if you're already doing okay and you can get a a credit card, for example, start with a credit card. If you have, for example, a bad credit and you cannot get back on your feet fast enough because you have to have some kind of good credit because this is what the credit bureau wants. So you need to get a credit card. The best way to do it is a secure credit card. You can put in the money up front as a security in case you default. They give you an average amount of money that you can spend and then they report it to the credit bureau. And then after that, you can say, hey, turn it into a regular credit card. And that's what you should do. But here is the biggest question, which is how do I get credit if I have no credit, bad credit, I had bankruptcy, I had this, or I have nothing at all. I'm new, I'm young, I just graduated from college. How do I get a good credit? Do I go to the financial institution and ask for? Do I go and just apply for credit everywhere? The, que the answer to these questions is no, don't do any of that because each time you go and somebody checks your credit, your credit score will go down if you have credit. It doesn't matter if it's a good credit or bad credit. The best way that I do it is a secret method that you can inherit. It's an inheritance credit, I call it. I have done it over 60 times to other people especially the youngest people that I know, basically they start having good credit in a very short period of time without them opening a credit card, without applying for credit, without any of that stuff. But this is a secret that I use. But if you want to know exactly how does that work, uh, you can put down in the comments, you want to know exactly how to do it. And I'll think about it and see if there's enough people who are interested in that subject. And I will make a video about it. If you want to make money through passive income, I created a course where you can get started very quickly, start making money. If you want to do that, click up here and start your journey. And as usual, I will see you at the top.